So J. Cole makes a plea to Kanye West during the Dreamville Fest performance. Hey, what's up? I'm A-Dub, and check this out. So J. Cole had asked Kanye West to clear the sample for his fan favorite song, Vilmatic. His plea came during his co-headlining performance alongside Drake at Dreamville Fest in his native North Carolina on Sunday night, April 2nd. Towards the end of his set, Cole performed Vilmatic for the first time in over a decade, blending it with his show-stealing guest first from Benny the Butcher's Johnny P's Caddy. Shout out to Kanye West. Please clear the sample for me, my brother. Appreciate you. Taken from J. Cole's 2010 mixtape, Friday Night Lights, Vilmatic borrows its beat from Kanye's My Beautiful Dark Twisted Fantasy cut, Devil in a New Dress. Friday Night Lights was released for free to rave reviews, racking up over a million downloads on the popular mixtape website, Datpiff, while helping Cole land a record deal with Jay-Z's Rock Nation. However, the project remains absent from streaming services, not for lack of trying on Cole's part though. On his 10th anniversary in November 2020, he said in an Instagram post, my dream is to one day have this on DSPs where it belongs. Before that, in 2013, he spoke about wanting to re-release Friday Night Lights commercially, along with his previous mixtape, 2009's The Warm Up, which is also currently unavailable on streaming platforms. The 20 song project features a plethora of other samples, including Erykah Badu's Didn't You Know, Too Deep for the Intro, Cassie's Must Be Love, Back to the Topic, and Stevie Wonder's My Sharia Moore, Love Me Not, although it's unclear if those have been cleared. Kanye West, who is much less active on social media these days after almost derailing his career in 2022 thanks to his anti-Semitic outburst, has yet to respond to J. Cole's sample clearance request. But the pair have shared a rocky relationship in recent years, with many fans believing Cole subliminally dissed Kanye on his 2016 song, False Prophets. Apart, but we deny it. Justifying a half ass shitty drop, we always buy it. When he tell us he a genius, but it's clearer lately. It's been hard for him to look into the mirror lately. There was a time when this nigga was my hero, maybe. That's the reason why his fall from grace is hard to take. J. Cole also appears to unload some shots at Kanye West on 2019's Middle Child rapping. Ye finally responded the following year by demanding a public apology from J. Cole during one of his famous Twitter tirades. I need a publicly apology from J. Cole and Drake to start with immediately. I'm Nat Turner, I'm fighting for us, I'm not putting no more music out till I'm done with my contract with Sony and Universal. On God, in Jesus' name, come and get me. I have the utmost respect for all brothers. We need to link and respect each other. No more dissing each other on labels we don't own. But they did appear to have patched things up when they shared a pleasant exchange on social media last February following the release of Kanye's genius Netflix docuseries. J. Cole said on Instagram, Thank you for this, Kanye West, Cootie Rock. Phenomenal, vulnerable, powerful, sad, inspirational, insightful, wonderful, masterful. Grateful to have watched. Kanye wrote back saying that's love family while sharing a screenshot of Cole's post on his own Instagram page. But do you think Kanye West is going to agree to clear Vilmatic for J. Cole? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and notification bell to stay up to date on all of our new videos. And as always, make sure to keep it all the way locked to popdx.com.